Hello you beautiful people and welcome back to Let's Play Warmer 40k in Crystal Prophecy in another round where we will begin and talk to Om Omicron. What was all that down there, Tech Priest? Did I witness some tech heresy just now? No. I connected to a pure machine spirit, which had been upgraded to serve a specific purpose. I'm 100% certain of that. While my voice box was utilized by the machine spirit, the communion gave me partial access to some routines. So it is not an AI. It is not an abominable intelligence. It is something extraordinary. By sacred digital apotheosis and uploading rituals, a penitent soul became part of this machine spirit. It was not the creation of a sentient intelligence, but the blessed fusion of man and machine. What are you doing now? Filing away the memories in the sonic requilleries. Giving you the coordinates I received from the machine spirit. Lord Klosterheim is currently in the research cloister. Alright. Machine spirit. The machine spirit of the Mata is trying to protect a great secret hidden on the abandoned fortress monastery. It seems to consider it seems to consider me an ally against Klosterheim, who was so dedicated to finding the secret that he was willing to order his own tech priest to override various segments of the machine spirit. What he doesn't seem to know, however, is that this machine spirit is unique. A very long time ago it reached Apotheus when a penant soul became part of the machine spirit by sacred digital apotheosis and uploading rituals. It was not the creation of a sentient intelligence but the blessed fusion of man and machine to complete a mission. Okay, and we travel to the next location and just hop into it, right? Not, right? What else should we do? Klosterheim's trail. Perhaps I was too suspicious of the tech priest. Suspicious, sorry, of the tech priest. After all, his plan worked the audience. His plan worked. The audience with the machine spirit was successful, and now I'm ready to follow Klosterheim's trail. On second thoughts, this is nonsense. An inquisitor can never be too suspicious. Klosterheim is heading toward an area marked as Forbidden. It is cut off from the dominion of the machine spirit. I'm on my way. I also need an explanation as to why anyone would tamper with the machine spirit in such an irregular way. Although the chances are infinitesimal, complex machinery may be vulnerable to the corruption of chaos. For some reason, Uther Tiberius wanted to reduce even that small chance to zero. I want to know more about that. Keep me updated. Charging battery. Okay, and off we are to follow Klosterheim's trail. I mean, that is not happening often in the campaign of Inquisitor Martyr, but I do remember the layout here. Fun fact for me. Inquisitor, I have analyzed the records of my communion. The administrator prayers in the digital marginalia indicate that Uther Tiberius fused an incorruptible soul with the machine. But that is impossible. Unless... Unless you sacrifice someone who fought off a demon and became immune to corruption. Agreed. Subject would be a former demon host. Is that even permitted? I could list 136 sects within the Adeptus Mechanicus, which would start a doctrinal purge based solely on such a notion. But my sect has always believed in digital martyrdom. I consider this machine spirit a miracle. Now that you have access to the main core... 
Inquisitor, I've just completed my diagnostic meditations and reviewed the data. We can safely rule out the infection as the cause of your hallucinations. What is it? My theory is that the visions might be residual memories leaking through a hasty mind scrub. They could have been triggered by certain phrases or events. That's nonsense. Stop obsessing about my mental condition. As you command, Inquisitor. Well, um, a couple of things I didn't even know, and I know a tinsy little bit about the 40k universe that you become immune to war powers, or not war powers, but to demon Loading. corruption, if you have successfully fought one demon before. That was actually new to me, or the game is unprecise in the background here, which is possible as well. implies that he was trying to create a whole army of them. Uther Tiberius condemned a whole army to eternal suffering? Note that the attached confession scrolls clearly prove that most subjects were volunteers. Any progress, Inquisitor? Looks like I'm closing in on Klosterheim. We may have an agenda, but at least he is culling the filth. Oh yeah. A army of demon hosts. Okay, that is a little bit scary. Yes, I get it. I know the mistake I did. Incorrect. You are only approaching the gate of the research cluster, currently under quarantine. The most pedantic specialist I've ever had in my retinue. Comment filed away for later evaluation. I found the remains of a dead tech priest. I suspect he is the one responsible for overriding the local systems. Search the body for additional information, Inquisitor. Status update, Unit Data Predator Ishmael Kell, code barriers implemented successfully, sorry, controls and or access of cogitators by external operators hampered drastically. Uh, main navigation cogitator, cog, cog, oh my goodness, cogitator, warp drivers, kinetic engines and jella subsystems are quarantined. Chances of another spontaneous jump converging to zero disapproval of the machine spirit is clear my actions are treated as hostile behavior in progress Exten ex sorry extensive areas of the ship are sealed and protected by ancient or unknown protocols attempt of remote access failed manual override deemed to be the only viable option direct orders of lord and christopher klosterheim are categorized as code heresy, aberrating the motive force and contradict the thrice blessed um, protocols of the machine god, protected vector, downward spiral to attack heresy and or extreme rebuke from the machine spirit, constellation of other actions, calculate unwise, calculated unwise, aborting our actions, also calculated unwise, the unit needs thorough analysis from the fabricator locum. Sigma, 7, Omega, 3, 5, Alpha. Interesting. The machine spirit is trying to communicate with us again. That is the emergency code for the lockdown protocols. The research cloister has been quarantined. You might not be able to leave if you enter. I should return to my ship then and make preparations before I enter that area. And that, guys, right now already leads us to the end of this episode and you know it i as usual really really thank you for watching if you guys actually do have enjoyed this episode then please give me a little thumbs up and subscribe and hopefully and hopefully i see you in the next system sorry in the next episode until then have a nice day stay frosty bye